Uh, you've seen my videos with my uh, mini mating nukes here. I don't know if I'm in frame here. If you look right there, there's a queen cell. Take my jackknife here. I've already took a frame out of a mating nuke. There was some bees in here before, but they've left. There's a bunch of uh, nectar in there to give them a start. Scraping it right off from plastic. See, I got it. Looks like I got it pretty good. It's a pretty good size queen cell. I found a couple of them that have been opened. I don't know what's going on. This was the hive that on Memorial Day I found a swarm and they went back into the hive well that evening. My nephew, I just put the frame here. Oop, I knocked the can on. I made a little hole. Yeah, I'll show you. I made a little hole right in the comb. So I'm just going to push that in there. Just kind of Give it a little touch with my thumb there. Don't take much to hold it in there. Oh, I'm knocking it all over here. Let me get you back here a little bit so you can see now. Uh, I'm just using a fence post here. My little mini tripod. Stuck in the top of it here. That ought to be good. Anything out of the way? Sitting on loop right up here on the cement block so you can see. I'm going to take her, I'm going to put her in the middle frame. Actually, I'm going to take her right out like that now. Can you see up on the hive? I think I'm going to do this right up over the hive. Just like that. There's one of the queens right there. So I'm going to put this frame right back in that hive. She's not piping, but I got that cell out of there just in time. A couple little patch here you want. I'm even going to do a second one. She's already running around. I'm just going to hunt this guy down and kill him. I'm going to cut one off another thing. Nice thing. I'm going to tie. I'll sit you guys back down here. As you can see, there's a big fat saw right there. Right to the foundation, down each side, across the top. I'm just going to scrape the foundation. These are built out pretty good, so I'll be able to do this fairly easy. Yeah. That one looked like the queen had died, in, so I'm not going to use that one. cells on the bottom. And, you know, okay. I'm going to go back there and train my hands. I'm going to pour open on that one.
that one. See, he never finished developing them. I'm just going to take the one I got. Hopefully that's a good one. Maybe not. I did see the virgin in there. Right up here. Cover the side. I don't want to fill these. I'm gonna have to get back here because I want to make sure I ain't shaking that queen. Now. All right, we're back. I pull a frame here to still have some uh, cat brew. So these will, most of these will look, all look like young nurse bees. I'm gonna try to move this up over the hive here, so. This. Take that, and you know, bunch of bees right in there. pretty much how you do it. Now I'll put a little jar of sugar syrup on these to keep them fed for a couple days. I'll check them in a few days and make sure they match out. There's a good clump of bees right on the front there. I think I'm just going to take my hive tool. I'm going to scrape them right in there also. settle down and thanks for watching that's how you get the queen cell into a mini mate you know.